Swinging your arms while running does nothing for your speed, according to a new study. Well, (laughs) not so sure that was the point, but let's see what the study finds. (laughs) Like and subscribe, please. Scientists say the common thought is swinging your arms while running propels you forward and acts as a counterbalance to the momentum of your legs. And now researchers from Southern Methodist University have discovered that arm swinging isn't so important to speed. Athletes who ran with their arms closed across their chest ran nearly as fast as when they ran with their normal arm swing. (laughs) Yeah, probably. Maybe until they fell flat on their face. (laughs) Have you ever tried to run without moving your arms? (laughs) Don't try it. I don't want to get sued. Most of the video we show here comes from the media release on the study. Peter Wayand, co-author of the study and leader of SMU's Locomotor Performance Lab, said, quote, Our findings suggest the classic view that arm swing directly drives leg motion to affect performance is not well supported. The team studied the velocity of track athletes who competed a 30-meter sprint with swinging arm motion and then another sprint with restricted arm motion. Running with restricted arm motion slowed down their race time by only 0.08 seconds on average. The difference between using and not using your arms for sprint performances was a mere 1.65% difference. (laughs) Remember, guys. These are track athletes who are used to running. (laughs) Try to get me out there to run without my arms, and you might as well put a blindfold on me and tell me to ride a bike. (laughs) Now, don't get me wrong. I love SMU. I get their point. But unless I've been living under a rock all my life, I thought it was about balance first and more efficient use of energy. But I digress. When participants ran without swinging their arms, the team noticed extra rotation in their torsos, which could be countering the force of their swinging legs. That's the whole efficiency thing I was talking about. They conclude that the arm motion keeps your body facing forward. I would think that all of this side-to-side rotation is really inefficient, and sure enough, that is kind of their point. Does this mean you should start keeping your arms tucked when running? Probably not, as there were only slight differences in racing times. However, the study does help researchers understand the role of arm rotation in running, so it was a useful endeavor. Go SMU! And if you ever have seen an Olympic race, you know that .08 seconds can mean the difference between winning and losing. (laughs) But I would give both my arms to see this test on (laughs) non-athletes. See what I did there? We have a lot more info on this and other studies. Just click the link in the description below and head over to studyfinds.com.